What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. We're about to get into crushing. Uh, she came from church one night. Um, this is when Carlissa claimed she lied, but basically she confirmed that she spoke to Blueface. Let's get into it. Oh, y'all all really like happy birthday. Thank you for celebrating me on my live right now. This is so cute. But I had so much fun, y'all. Like, church was really fun. And then, like, um, you know, I've been going through a lot this week. Like, just, like, all that internet stuff. Like, with all these other mother... Like, my don't like me just on the internet popping it. And then, like, I don't know, just having people pull up at my house unannounced and aggressive uh, in an aggressive way that's dead like i didn't i didn't with that like you know like i just been having one of those weeks um blue been on lock he's finally not on lockdown so when he called me while i was in church i was just happy i was just overfilled with joy like okay you're 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 okay you're not on the hold no more and you're fine not on the you hold. feel me so there's nothing to worry about and All then right. plus i made it to 24. god is great and not like that, but a lot of people died at 23, 22, 21, 19, out the womb. Like, I'm blessed to say I made it to 24, so thank you, Jesus, for real. And then, um, for everybody that's going through something right now, I just feel like if you got something, take it to God and just be like, hey, God, I want to do this, but I want to make sure it's done right. So, like, a lot of times we wouldn't do a, a lot of things that we should do because we feel like it's not the right time. You just ask God to make the right opportunity for you to know it's the right time to do it. Because sometimes that could be the very most thing that's holding you back, like fear and shit. So I've been having this um, thing when I don't know if I should uh, drop my song or... It's too much going on, so I don't really know what... um, So I'm just holding music and just sitting on it and just waiting for him. But, um, yeah, he all called me like, what you out cheating? How am I going to cheat, bro? Great. Like, <laughs> I got you in my face. Hello. I cut everybody off. Everybody Hello. that I used to talk to and f*** with. Let's just like, keep it at, I got you on my face. So that's why she not going outside, because he think if she go outside, she cheating, Lord. You know my little roster? <sighs> they block. I haven't talked to him. I don't talk to him. You know what I'm saying? I don't talk to nobody. I will be just waiting for my baby to over the car. So I'm like, bro, I'm really holding it down for real. Like, I know it's hard to believe that. Trust me. We went through so much that you would think that this is the time when I'm on you. I was already on him when he was outside. So it was like... When he called me and let me know that he needed me. I already had my time, fair game, and share of shit with him. So it was like, when he called me, like, my p- better not be shaved. It's not shaved. Chill out. Jesus. It ain't shaved. I'm not by Chill out. Stop crying. That control be crazy. I ain't really, I ain't outside. Y'all know, bro. I'll be at Rolling Loud right now. Y'all know where I'll be at. I'll be at Rolling Loud. I'll be That's where I would be. Shows. I'll be dropping That's music. where I would be. I'll just be doing shit. But right now, I'm just being like... Obedient. You know, down. Like, when somebody really needs you. Like, you know, he really need me. I really need him. We, we cool. We cool. What? He needs you to pick up the phone. That's what you're doing. And if you was at Rolling Loud, you would pick up the phone. <laughs> that's not down. That's whatever, girl. She gonna do what she want. <laughs> you feel me? It's just kind of crazy. I don't even know why she be telling people and explaining and all that. Because we ain't gonna understand. <laughs> Lord knows I don't understand. I'm telling you, I don't really... um. Like, I do what I want. Like, I don't... Cap. I'm not going to not do what I want. Like, if I want to hold down, hold you down and wait for you and not do not want other people, that's for real. That's really me saying I want to hold you down because I'm really going to hold you down. Like, I'm not going to... I'm not going to tell you and not do it. That's what I'm not going to do. 
And yeah. then, like I said, if I do want to um, step out, no, I'm going to put the whole little relationship off. I'm not going to step out, have that shit going on. on the, like, who, do you know who I am? Yeah. Krishan, we know who you are. I got that, that good, that good whoop de woo down there. Oh, Jesus. As soon as I let that shit unleashed, everybody and their mama going to know who the fuck I'm with. And then it's like, I don't like doing shit. Why? I'm not the type of bitch to be doing the shit. I want to love be really out loud about it. Like. Or like, you know, at least funny with it. Like. <sighs> She probably really didn't give Case Wave no cooling. What y'all think? What y'all think? Because I don't think she was trying to get nothing. I can't wait to lay down. It's six o'clock in the morning. Y'all think I'm lying? Uh, but uh, easy. I'm just happy he's safe. I'm happy church ended. I just had so much fun in church though. Like, Five fifty two. Church be so much fun, even when like, and yeah. then like, say if it's on days like this, like. I feel so good going to church on a Friday because, you know, anybody else did be going to a club, nigga house. And that's all right. <laughs> it's all right either way. And y'all keep saying what I could be doing. I'm telling you, I'm doing what I want to do right now. Like, I'm nothing is not holding me back from being the best me. Like, when Blue start holding me back and I start getting in more trouble and y'all... Y'all start seeing me online, going back and forth with, forth with bitches, or you feel me? Like when you start seeing me not being me, then start, Krishan. You know this ain't really like. I wouldn't go back and forth with now other bitch. You don't need to. She might need to be in the house. I ain't even gonna lie to you. <laughs> At least she ain't fighting. No. I'm not finna be playing with blue like a little girl. Like, I'm a grown ass woman. My son is my son. So, yeah, like, shit different. I ain't letting none of that shit fly or I used to be on, I used to cry about, this shit I used to get drunk about. I don't do none of that. Like, what? Right. None of that. I don't do none of that. I don't do none of that. And vice versa. Like, he's not gonna put up with shit either. So, it's like, Okay, now that, yeah, what? But I'm just so happy that he's okay. Like, it been 15 days without talking to this nigga because he's on the hold. On the hold is crazy. That eyelash, she gotta get that. And eyelash. I know that suck for him because it's like, damn, you know? Mm -hmm. No, that just got me for real. I'm about to take the lashes off. Where my shades at? I think I lost my shades. Five, five, five in the chat. <clears throat> I wanted to cry because when I realized that, I'm like, did I really just lose my shades? They're the only ones that's keeping me together. You know, I'm like, did I really just lose my shades? Like, what the fuck? Like, what the fuck? I know I should be taking a break. Like, just being able to um, move around how I want to move around. Like, move around how I want to move around. Be comfortable, and then this is the most time I've ever been at peace. Like, not like that, but I love blue to death. But since he been in jail, nigga, I ain't no toxic going on. He's able to think clear. What he eat, he say things clear. I can understand him. He got no drugs. <laughs> he doing better off of with no drugs. We get along. <laughs> Nigga, I just been okay. You hear me? No drama. The <sighs> only drama I can't really get with is that that little happened at the house with the father. Like, who is some people that came? Like, I'm still asking myself, like, who is some people? Like, imagine somebody, imagine somebody out front of your house with a gun, waiting for somebody to come outside, so you can run in. So they can run in. Just imagine somebody. Like why? Like why you picking up your kid, putting him into bed? There's somebody outside with a mask and a gun. Like that. Shit, like 
diabolical. Come like, on, it's like use at this it. Point, that's our new word now, y'all. Stop doing it. Because, like, um, you mess around and go in the wrong house and think that it was sweet. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, I know. I'm telling you. Like, that's not cool. And then it's like, why do you want to take something that's not yours? Like, this world is getting real thin. Like, like what's going on? Like, Krishan, people are struggling, honey. Mm -hmm. People are struggling. The price of living is entirely too high. Ridic Today I got soap for the house, toothpaste, mouthwash. Don't get me wrong, I don't get the dollar. I don't. Um, and that ain't no shade. I broke or not, I'm going to get what I like to have. It could be my last. I'm still going to get it. Um... It was $150. It was $150. So when you got people outside like, yeah, I'm rich as hell. I just made $170,000 two hours ago. And you go outside, somebody going to want to take that $150,000, Krishan. That's why, you know, listen, whatever y'all believe, the DM I got today was hilarious. But listen, I want y'all to Whatever you think of me, thank that sh Especially the broke one. <laughs> Baby, I ain't got it. You know what I'm saying? Um, you ain't going to find me out here talking about, yeah, baby, I just made 100000 last last couple hours ago. Even if I did, I didn't. You know what I'm saying? Because, <laughs> nah, I understand. People are really struggling out here. It ain't no joke. It's really not. Dying, people get people. It's just like it's so much evil. It's like it's no point. It's no more. It's no point in being um. There to have relations with. <laughs> I don't think it's jail talk. I think it's the fact that sometimes when you have time to sit to, sit by yourself and then like analyze your thoughts, like time, like actual forced time to like. Be Hold on before she say that. That's another thing I've been wanting to address. A lot of y'all saying it's not love that he had for Krishan. Um, I'm not going to lie with the example of his mother. He don't know what love is, I'm sure. Um, but it's something about her. Might be the control factor uh it just might be the what she got in between her legs i don't know um but girl it's something okay you know i never feel like love is enough anyway so it got to be more than some love and you can love a person and not care about them at all so you know it's something it's something there it's something as as bad as we don't like it, it, it is what it be is. Be off your phone, be off the social media, be off the the hurt feelings. Like when you have like that legit rawness, like to center you. Like for example, like when you fast, right? You get rid of everything. Like you stop smoking, you stop um, eating certain carbs. So you probably just intake bread. You don't eat like fancy. You just eat stuff that whatever, or you don't eat at all. Long story short, it's the fact that you get stripped away. You take things away. You sacrifice um, what's not so healthy for what's healthy. So This wasn't an intentional I sacrifice. I feel like not like that, but jail. That's why you see a lot of people go in jail and come out. They skinny. They want to work out, eat right. Because it's kind of it kind of like sometimes jail for people put you in a perspective to like, I don't know, just be a better person or be a better you. So like, um. I don't know. It's just one time I uh, left jail before. When I, I did jail for like 12 days straight. I thought, uh, you know, that whole little case in Oklahoma or whatever. Um, little case in Oklahoma. I was I fasted. Like, I didn't eat. Um, so when I came out of jail, right, like when I fasted and prayed and stuff like that, you know, you, you don't smoke every day. Like I, So, but it was just crazy because right before I went in there, I was smoking so crazy. But then when, like, me being off of, like, smoking and having any, like, the outlet to like 
put my hurt feelings into the wrong areas. Like, it was just weird. Like, how when all that was taken away and I was, like, sh strictly had to stick on this because I am in jail, um, something fell off of me, like, from my body that my, like, like you don't need to smoke for real. So now, like, when I hit a blunt or whatever, I just be smoking, but I don't smoke as much. Like, I used to go through zips a day. I used to smoke a zip a day. Like, Damn. That's how bad it was. Like, I'll wake up three blunt. If I'm talking blunt, if I wake up, blunt, like, it's just blunt after blunt. Now, I barely even get to, like, get around to it because it'd be so annoying to hit it. Like, it's too much smoke. And then I don't, and that's not, and then, like, say, if, um, I'm late to buy weed, like, for a day or two to smoke, I'll go, like, those days without smoking for real. And it, it won't bother me. So I'll be feeling like. That's real important to a, um, a ganja smoker because they, they really do that. I, I really, you know, it's a I really smoke thing. So when they go a couple of days without it, that's a good thing. Like, no, jail kind of, like, discipline a person, like, intellectually, spiritually. It, it's, like, a little thing that happens to I don't know. That's from my experience. Like, when I went to jail, um, it forced me to let a lot of things go. So when I came out of jail, I was, for real, remember when I came out of jail, I was less likely, like, well, I feel like my baby changed me, too. Like, when I had my child. Like, one time, like, usually, um... Oh, you said it does? Right. Y'all agree with me, right? Because this eyelash coming off, but I'm trying my hardest to keep it on. Child, let that thing that come crying. off. Lizzo looks really good. Yeah, the Holy Spirit do changes you too. But it's like you gotta like strengthen your spirit. Like you know how like you hungry? You feeding your flesh. Like you feeding your flesh food. Like you really your spirit your spirit get hungry too. So you guys feed your spirit and what you feed your spirit you just the word meditating. Um me, what I do is, uh, that's why you don't really see me on Instagram, bro. Because I really, like, took a, a real break from just, like, being on my phone, and period. Being online. I feel on that. Like, I used to um, post every second of the day, like, if I felt like it. Like, just to chat with my followers, like, oh, I'm up here doing this. Uh, I'm, over, I'm over here doing that. You know what I'm saying? But now I'm really slow to do any of that, like, um... Not because I don't want y'all to know what I'm doing, but only because, um, I don't know. It's, it's just like, the more you save, the more they be like anticipating, like if you give them too much. Like sometimes you can give them, but you can't do it all the time. Like I used to vent to y'all a lot, you feel me? But mm -hmm. now that I don't know more, it's just, it's just play a good, it's just play, play a nice little role. Got it. Yeah, I don't care about the views dropping. The views dropping all the time. When every time I talk about Jesus, or if I'm not talking about drama, or if I'm not talking about um something, y'all always leave the chat. That's cute. I'm here for the people that want to just talk to my dumb ass. Because I just came from church, and church was so good. And the word was so good. Now I'm just ready to drop music. I'm ready to... Uh, no comment. Sure. Excuse me. I'm telling you, I just want to do it right. I don't really want to do it fast. Like, and it's not like I'm waiting on somebody or waiting on something. It's like, I'm telling you, it's like you'll be in your head telling you like, all right, but you got to do this. You got to do that. No, you just have to act and do and just go. You feel me? Not act, do, and I don't know. Like, I can't explain it because I be feeling like, I ain't gonna lie, every time I get on camera, I start fidgeting. I, I guess Do you we mind all plugging do. this up for me, sir? Huh? Do you have this cord? Uh, what's that? What are we doing with it? Is this plugged up? Hold on. Uh, no. Oh, yeah, it's charged. It's cool. Is, is that okay? Yeah, that's good. You good. So, okay. yeah, you, yeah, you need it. Thank okay. you. Okay. Sorry about that.
No, but I've been like, um, a drama freak. Um, I've been focused, bro. Like, I've been spending so much time in the studio. I got time to actually, like, think about what I want to say. Like, I got this one song, right? It's about, okay, so those days that Blue spent so forever in the hole, it, it was weird. Like, for me, when I went to the studio, I was able to talk to myself as if I'm on the phone with him, like, I miss you. Like, but I was able to put it into a song. So it's like, it's such a vibe, bro. It's like, I like being inspired on the way of, like, when I'm going through stuff, I can get my ideas. She likes pain music. You can't serve two masters. What are you talking about? I don't have a master. I just serve God, bro. Yes, I have a blue face. Get the f over it. <laughs> all you, all this hate train off me, f with a nigga, it's kind of like laid out. You feel me? <laughs> yeah. I don't care what the f you, you doing. You f I f I know your backyard don't look like mine. It's just crazy. What would Jesus say about that? I think what Jesus say about my relationship is to clean it up and marry him if I'm going to be serious. Like, I can't be like, I need a man of God. Like, I can't be doing this in, like, in between relationship and we wait to marry each other. At one point, you know, I was with her on the God thing, and I'm saying God thing because I feel like that's what that is. And I'm not, because um, I can't judge nobody who has their own relationship with them, so mm -mm, that ain't what I'm doing. But it's not something that I like to listen to. I'm not going to lie. Um, for her to be so into God, but... When people say they're into God and then they, they get to throwing that Bible at you and, you know, all these projections. And then, you know, she say, I need a man of God. And the fact that she think it's going to be blue face is. It's rather diabolical, like she said. But, you know, like she said, she's going to do what she want to do. Get over it. You ain't got her backyard. Okay. All right. We have a sex without marriage. Like, yeah, like, what would Jesus say to this? Um, take it slower this time. And I'm glad that he, not like that, but we got time to take it slow. All we do is just talk, get to know each other. And then, like, we building up this foundation on trust. So it's like. Trust and he thank you out having sex and you at church. Man. Man, man, man. I don't know what Jesus would say about what's going on because I don't see me doing nothing wrong. Somebody that hit Krishan, but what would Jesus we do? We ain't having sex. All we is just getting getting along and getting a better perspective. But then she'll say, tomorrow, I can't wait till he get home so we can. So when she gets to talking that God and. Uh uh. <laughs> don't want to hear it. <laughs> I was cool with it at first. I was drunk. He not a man of him that's the thing about it he do he's he not god. a man of god though don't know him <laughs> okay it's things that he need to work on as being whoever he is a better person but everybody has that oh, you feel me man. i'm not hating i'm praying for looking up to her no the girls that look up to me they don't look up to me because of my relationship mm. I, like bitches look up to me because of how authentic and how like don't give a f like I'm very transparent and if I am gonna be a buck about a situation let's talk about it. nobody's scared or embarrassed to be like all right this is what's going on my yeah you I feel like I mean so you saying you got I've been got delivered though like when I was pregnant I was getting delivered when I when I left and did it on my own, on my own shit, and start demanding my respect. Man. I want y'all to know, my reactions are just as temperamental as people are, okay? So they have temperamental moments, I'm temperamental with them. 
I, I, I speak on how they feeling in that moment. Then I'll speak on how they feeling in the moment tomorrow. I speak on how they feeling next week. Okay. So if you feel like my reactions change, which some people, some of y'all say that in the comments, their opinions change, their actions change. I'm reacting to it. Mine going to change too. Um, and I mean how I'm speaking on or see them, but I'm done with this video. Um, we all know Krishan's going to do whatever it is she wants to do. And, you know, that's all I got. Can't wait till he get out. I cannot wait till he get out. We are going to have a show for us because he going to have a lot to say. I don't know why she think he about to go to church and get baptized and drink communion. Yeah, just, well, the wine for communion. Whatever. I'm never here at, at 6 a.m. So I don't I don't know what that sound is. Y'all probably don't hear it. But anyway, um, let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. I'm done with this video. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.